Mount Madison, here we come. <laughs> this is easily the coolest places I have ever hammocked. I am up above the ground about five feet maybe above this rock I can swing from and I am looking at Mount Washington and Mount Madison is over there I think not really sure and then we've got a waterfall down there and another waterfall over there so this is this is really cool I'm really enjoying this it's a beautiful day out um, we were going to climb Mount Madison today and go to the hut that's on the other side of the mountain of the peak and stealth camp somewhere near there, but uh, we took a lot of breaks and my pack weighs 32 pounds, which is the heaviest it's ever weighed. So we weren't moving too fast today, so we only did five miles and came to the Osgood campsite, I think that's what it's called. We're just chilling, we're going to do Madison and Washington tomorrow. So you guys will uh, you guys will see some pictures and videos. So climbing Madison right now, that's what I'm doing. And like a quarter of the way up, my sleeves were really making me mad because I got really sweaty. They stuck to my arms, so I cut them off. So no sleeves now. And I'm gonna show you guys what we're doing today. Cause I just, oh, ow, ow. Ah. Okay. Let's try that again, because oh, I'm about to summit Madison in a bit, and I got this awesome view. So, there you guys go. That really big mountain with the tower on it is Mount Washington, and we're doing this entire bridge walk today. So, yeah, it's going to be really cool. I'm going to take lots of videos so I can show you guys. Ow! Jeez, and I sent my shoes home for good, so it's all in the sandals now, and it hurts, but there's Mount Washington right there. Only five miles from where we are. Yeah. <laughs> Wind speeds reaching up to 200 miles per hour and temperatures dropping below freezing even in the summer. The peak is accessed. <laughs> We got some free oatmeal here at the Madison Hut. We got a big old thing right there of oatmeal. Me and Littlefoot went halvesies on a loaf of bread. So I've got a I've got a loaf of half a loaf of bread right here. It's four bucks. It's a really nice hut. Everyone's pretty cool here. They got a ton of food. Bye Madison Hut. See you. Maybe later. There is Mount Adams, there's Littlefoot, and Mount Washington is just over five miles from here. <laughs> Trout, uh, tell everyone what your idea was. So we're crossing the road up Mount Washington today, right now. Yep. And we're not supposed to do Mount Washington till tomorrow, so we're gonna hitch up, check it out, hitch back down, and start hiking there. Nice. <laughs> All right, let's try to get a ride. There's the railroad that goes up Washington. It's um, just way down there. It goes up to Mount Washington. Just up there.
So over there are the wildcats. And if you can see, right there, that's the gondola, that little thing. That's where we were a couple days ago when we did the slack pack. And we did all of that back to Gorham. There's Lake of the Clouds down there, about a mile away. I'm gonna try to get work for stay, but it's already six, so we're probably not gonna get it. But oh well, hopefully they'll take us. Absolutely gorgeous up here. And trout's here. <laughs> <laughs> Check out this weather. It all rolled in last night. A complete whiteout. There's trout in the background. <laughs> Can't see anything. And we have to hike in this. <laughs> oh, that's that's fine. Oh, oh my God, where are we? Oh, I don't think we are in the Alps anymore. These mountains. Very proud. Strange. No points. Not very hard. This is very weird where we are right now. We would have some good ice climbing here. Oh, yeah, very technical. Oh, very dangerous. Oh, this is such a very dangerous. Very dangerous. All right, all right, all right. What'd you say they were again? Canadian, I believe the ca Canadian Grey Jays. We just called them Grey Jays. Canadian Grey Jays. That, that one that just went in your hand. <laughs> Here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put it on my shoulder. <laughs> Don't look at it. Oh, I didn't stay. Do it again. Mm -hmm. We got to Crawford Notch. We're at Crawford Notch and we're about to hitch a 30 mile ride <laughs> to Lancaster, <laughs> New Hampshire to go to a cult <laughs> and, a sleep, and sleep for free at a commune. So we're getting a hitch from this nice man right here. So, this is going to be fun. It's going to be long and hopefully it doesn't rain on us again. 
It's Mount Washington up there. Way up there. Yeah, that's sweet. Yeah. So. Ow. Ow. This is this is the most agreeable trail I have been on this entire trip. It is it's so flat and there's like no rocks and roots because this used to be an old railway like place like a train used to run over here. So this used to be where the tracks were. <clears throat> That's why it's so nice. But it is absolutely gorgeous out here. I'm trying to make it, got about two miles to the hut. I'm gonna try to get to work for stay tonight. Look at that. That is so cool. It's been a beautiful day. I'm at the top of Garfield, I think, and I'm pretty sure I just saw like a ferret or a weasel or something. I was trying to get a video of it, but I couldn't get it. It ran away. Um, yeah, Garfield Ridge. That's where I'm at right now. I'm about to go to Lafayette. But yes, or two days ago when we climbed, climbed Washington, I also saw a, uh, I actually did see a weasel, like a long-tailed weasel or something. And yesterday, Littlefoot lost his phone and couldn't find it, and I lost my water bottle and my filter, so, well, that was a couple days now, so I've been going without my filter for a while, and this is what we have to climb before we can go into town today, Mount Lafayette, so we gotta go up that, and then we have to come down it, and then we'll be in town. I'm at the top of Garfield, I think, and... I'm pretty sure I just saw like a ferret or a weasel or something. I tried to get a video of it, but I couldn't get it. It ran away. Um, yeah, Garfield Ridge. That's where I'm at right now. I'm about to go to Lafayette. But yes, or two days ago when we climbed, climbed Washington, I also saw a, uh, I actually did see a weasel, like a long tailed weasel or something. And yesterday, Littlefoot lost his phone and couldn't find it and I lost my water bottle and my filter so well that was a couple days now so I've been going without my filter for a while and this is what we have to climb before we can go into town today Mount Lafayette so we gotta go up that and then we have to come down it and then we'll be in town No time, you know. Lord knows I'm weak. Won't somebody get me off of this Better than that. Cool. 
walk crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you pretty much go right down. I am currently climbing Mount Musalak. It is 6.48 p.m. And there are severe thunderstorms, thunder and lightning, rainstorms going on right now. So, um, trying to make it to town. It's like four miles or something. I'm not really sure. I'm trying to make it to town. So, looks like I'm be doing a bit of bit of night hiking tonight. Yay. So I was hiking and I see these headlights and I turn around and there's this car like zooming down this back country road and it stops and he's like, where are you headed? I was like, uh, to Glencliff eventually. So he's like, uh, get in. So he's picking up his daughter from babysitting right now and then he's going to drop me off at the road. It, it was raining like crazy ridiculous. So I'm very grateful for this man. His, his name is Tim. He's a pastor. And he's a great guy. Get him. Get him. Because they met you and Mallory. What the f I hear about that? How did you do it? You'll never understand, Wayne. You and me, we're not even the same species. I used to be you, then I evolved. From where you're standing, you're a man. From where I'm standing, you're an ape. You're not even an ape, you're a media person. Media is like the weather. This skunk just came right up to me. I think its sight is really bad. Come here. That's so cool. The the skunk. Frog. He looks injured. Injured. It's probably not the best idea. I hope he moves. You gotta get to town. We made it into Hanover last night, so we called a trail angel, and she let us, well, she set us up in a church, so we slept in a church last night, and um, I feel like crap, so I'm going to go get medicine, and then we're going to go hike out of here, get some free pizza or something, and uh, that's pretty much it. I'm going to end the video right here. Hopefully next time you don't see me, I don't have, next time you see me, I don't have Giardia, because that, that could be a possibility. I'm going to go get a new water filter today. And that's pretty much it. So, see you guys later.